I didn't meet her until she wound up being on a cruise ship where I was working mm -hmm. and she was playing at the piano bar and you know how it is when the guys be loving on you and yeah. she would climb up on the piano and we had already bought her 11 glasses of wine <laughs> <laughs> and I was just there for the mount and the dismount of the piano <laughs> I'm a very some... good mounter you really are <laughs> she's screaming I'm a top I'm a top I'm a top <laughs> So we do want to ask. Hi, mom. <laughs> <laughs> the camera's right there. Hi, mom. <laughs> so you sent us some pictures, and I just asked at the last minute, like, send me a couple of pictures, and she sent me a few. Yeah, and you had, okay, tell us about that one. <laughs> this is when my brother, sister, and I used it. We started out, and I was ten there. And it's when I got my first record deal at that age. At the 10? I did not. Oh my gosh. I had, we were on the telethon, the Jerry Lewis telethon. Remember when he used to have it? Yes. So we were Lewis. on that, yeah, in our area. I mean, he didn't oh, like right. call me yes, up yes. and ask me to lunch. Oh. I recorded my first record, and we did, uh, it was called The Girl, the Girl Next Door, and we, we did this little record. Oh and then we became, then my, then my brother quit. And we became the ladybugs, and you. And right now, I am actually in England. You can get a CD that has greats from the past, and I'm on it, singing as the ladybugs because you know the Beatles were really big back then. And he, I'm singing in an English accent, Fraternity Row, 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 you will say. What a fake accent! Oh my God, <laughs> English accent. You can always find her at PamelaStanley.com in case you're hunting. Let's see the next piece of stuff we found in your closet. Oh, oh, I love this one. This was my favorite. Yeah. My favorite. <laughs> Isn't that fun? I had to, we were at, we were auctioning our clothes at an AIDS benefit. Oh, no. That was his question. That Do you still have that outfit? And I thought all on my own. I said, you know what I wanted to know? Do you still have that in your closet? I know. No. Do you have anything from your yes. videos in your closet? I do. I have my leather skirts. and I, I From have the a video video. The skirt from the video? Yeah. Oh I, well, actually, some of the... I should have saved more, shouldn't I? Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah but th that auctioned right off my body that night. So some queen in Hollywood owns it. <laughs> some tiny little Filipino is wearing that right now. Because I am actually a size drag queen. You, girl, are not anymore. You are not. I really did it. Well, show us another one, baby. Oh, oh that is so cute. Is that Provincetown or not? This is Gay Pride in uh, Delaware, in Rehoboth Beach. Oh, in Rehoboth. We got a couple of Rehoboth uh -huh. guys. Yay! <laughs> Do you remember that? And uh, I was doing If Looks Could Kill, and I look out in the audience, and I see these guys all in leather, and I thought, I'm doing If Looks Could Kill. These guys are in this show. They didn't even know it, so I went out and I grabbed them, and I brought them up, and I said, I told them, I'm losing. just pick me up, just pick me up, and that's what they did. They picked you up, <laughs> That looks like a USO tour. No, that is at the Blue Moon. It is? That is not, these are the bartenders at the Blue Moon. The bartenders at the Blue Moon are straight. And, and I worked this fabulous gay club all summer in Rehoboth Beach, Delaware. And so every year we do two numbers a summer. And I was doing Candyman there, and they're the backups. So oh we God, did the Candyman so, video. They are like little pieces of candy. <laughs>